I'm about to go on strike. I'm about to go on strike and have them open up these barbershops because my hair is looking crazy. <laughs> Yo, what up? It's your boy Skylar Brazil, the music producer you can grow with. And today I have a bittersweet moment. So today I'm leaving a job that I've worked at for the past six years. I started off interning for seven months with no pay and then eventually was granted the opportunity to work for the music library that I worked for, Signature Tracks, for six years. It's been a long road and it's a definitely a bittersweet moment, but today I'm finally taking the step towards a new path and trying to make this music thing at a bigger scale. Ultimately, what made me want to make this decision is really, I really like helping other producers. I really like growing with other producers and artists and singers and rappers, and I like networking and growing that community, that creative community. I think I really like being creative more than anything. And this job has really taught me a lot of things that can help me amplify that part of my career. So I decided to take the steps to separate myself and take more time to focus on the career part of this, building my brand and really trying to network with different people and see where this goes, you know. Uh, I, it was, it's one of those moments where you go for it and I am thankful for the opportunity that I got. Like I, there's a lot that I can explain about it. Um, there's a lot of experiences I went through. I was fortunate enough to go to the VMAs with them. Uh, I Heart Music Awards. I've been in editing bays watching shows. I've been to like Real Housewives of Beverly Hills and Bender Pump Rules like premiere parties where the, the actresses and actors are actually there. It's been a great experience and there's a lot of different things that I've been through and I'm super appreciative for the opportunity that I had but I'm happy because I'm also taking that step into a new direction. I had great mentors over the time, uh, not only with my bosses, but my coworkers in general. I have some of the hardest working people alongside of me and it really inspired me to really kind of take this step. So I appreciate everybody who's been tuning in. This is a big step in my life, a big sacrifice. Um, you know, there's definitely so much opportunity in that area, it's, it's incredible. Uh, you can really make a living off that. There, I was making a living off that and there's a lot that you can learn from that. So if that's something that, a route that you wanna take, I suggest taking it because there's a lot of experiences that you can get from working for a music library. And I started off not knowing anything as far as like Excel or business or pulling playlists for TV or anything about TV in general. I just made music. I wanted an opportunity to get my music placed. So I took that internship and I'll show the email that I got. I actually got the opportunity from Full Sail University, but yeah, so I'm, I'm excited and I'm gonna kind of vlog the day and then kind of give some tips of how people can really get their music placed. I learned a lot. I actually dealt with the submission process part of it as well. So there's a lot of game I feel like I can give out there to people who have the quality, have the quantity and the right mindset because it takes a certain mindset for it. Don't just think you can turn in one or two tracks here and think it's gonna pop up. This is a long process compounding game. You know, you gotta be patient with it. You gotta water the plant. You gotta, it's like a plant, you gotta water it and you gotta, you gotta watch it grow and watch it grow. All right, so I wanna give some quick tips to, for people who are really trying to get placements. If you've tried before and you haven't really had any luck or if you're just kind of misdirected and don't really know how to get into that field, I'm trying to help you here. So here are three tips that I think that will really help people who are first trying to start out or trying to get placements. The first thing that I would do and recommend is when you're submitting your email for an application or if you see an application form for these music libraries to submit your music, make sure that you're making your email as simple and clear code as possible with an actual attachment of your tracks or a streaming leak make sure that you're not having these people go these extra steps to find your music if you're sending music on a certain uh, platform or a streaming link make sure it's really fast in response time don't have anything that's loading that's a little bit slower the second thing that I recommend and I've actually made a video about this and you can check it here is to make sure you have the right form formatting with your tracks I think if you can provide something outside of just your music um, when submitting to these things you will really stand out because you got to remember there's a lot of competition yes but at the same time the competition is not as saturated as the actual industry part of it, the music industry. For a more in detailed version of how to really maximize and get yourself placing on TV, uh, I do have a video course on it. I wanna be crystal clear, this is a long-term game. This is something that you're gonna see instant results in. It does take time. From the first placement you get, it usually takes about a year to see the actual first royalty check. But like I mentioned earlier, it's a lot like planting um, a plant. You really gotta water it and watch it grow. I promise you it will compound over time. I know people who um, are making tons and tons of money. I myself am able to support myself alone just off royalties and over time it compounds and that stuff reruns over time. So I do have a video course below for $47. If you do use the code right now, um, Xcalibur Zero, you are able to get 10% off on the uh, actual video course right now, but this is really gonna help anybody who's trying to take their music to a live. I have that link in the description below for the video course. Uh, let's connect. If you have any questions, please just let me know. That's all I gotta say. 
I talk too much in this video. I appreciate you. If you stay this long, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It's your boy, Caliber Zero, the music producer you can go with, and I'm on to the next chapter.